So, what's your plan, Mr. Garrett? How would you like to buy a bank? What the hell do we know about banking? Owning a bank is like owning the other side of the real estate business. There's a few complexities you just left out. Like what? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I not wake up black this morning? Because I'm pretty sure I did. Yep, still black. I got my head full of dreams. I came here to try my hand at real estate. <laughs> you mad a millionaire unit? <laughs> The time never I like seeing black men succeed. Sometimes I even invest some of my own money to back them. I know you're smart and ambitious. You and I both know that's not enough. It's time that someone shine a bright light in order for things to change. Are you starting to buy real estate in white-only neighborhoods? Keep one eye open. Think about all the good we can do for the community. Taking it to the man. That's exactly what we're going to do. <laughs> <laughs> and just how in the hell do you plan on pulling that off? We get Matt to front for us. You want me to what? Be us to the rest of the world. We can't set foot in the bank unless we to help. Should have took limo driver when you had the chance. I don't know anything about banking. I don't know how to buy a bank. We'll teach you everything you need to know. You gotta learn how to talk to rich white folks like you one of them. And you can't fake a golf game. Make me proud, son. The whole country's talking about how two Negroes managed to buy two banks full of white folks' money and loan it to other Negroes. <laughs> you should have known you couldn't keep this a secret very long. FBI, you're under arrest. A black man tries to bring other brothers up. That's intolerant. Oh, when you're working on fate. Oh, when you're living on fate. Something's got to give. Something's got to give. Even a rig gang's fun to play behind. Oh, if this was easy, somebody else would have done it a long time ago. Something's got to give. You're a revolutionary. Mm -hmm.